So today we're here at Fanuc America. We're gonna be meeting with David Renteria, one of the applications engineers here, and he's gonna walk us through their facility and show us some of their new exciting technology. Let's go check it out. Hey Dave. Hey Jesse, welcome to Fanuc America. So what do you guys do out of this facility? Fanuc America provides automation solutions for companies small and large. We're also an OEM and we sell robo drills and we do provide robotic services also. So we see you guys on you know, tons of different machine tools. We work with you all the time. I'd really like to see what you've got running out here in the showroom. Sure, let me show you our digital twin product. Yeah, let's check it out. So here's our visual twin, Jesse. This is pretty neat. Is that, is that actually the spindle I hear on there? Yeah, you can actually adjust the feed rate override. Look at that. I can even see the chips coming off. This is huge from a demonstration perspective, but also, you know, being able to prove things out and see things on the machine that you wouldn't be able to detect without cutting a multiple thousand dollar block of material. That's correct. This gives you full virtual five axis capability. It allows you to not only simulate your part, but you can also pick up things like surface finishes. I see the face mill leaving those marks on the part. So when you cut this, you actually saw all that stuff lined up. You actually see the real surface finishes of the part that itself. That is really neat. So I know you have one other digital twin demo you wanted to show us. You've actually got the part cutting out in your shop. We do. Right? Well, we should probably go out to the shop and check that one out. Sounds good, let's go. Let's go. Hey, here's our Fanuc RoboDrill, a master cam pose processor. Really allows us to do true five axis, three plus two type of applications. Yeah, and I know that was kind of the goal of this project. We worked together to get that post proven out, make sure everything worked the way it was supposed That's to. That's correct. With all your functions on the control and everything. Here's actually one of the finished parts, if you like to see it. Yeah, awesome. So looking at the programming here, you know, we were using the unified toolpath with Clean Core. With that digital twin software that you guys have, that makes that prove out so much easier, so much more confident when we're pushing the green button on the machine. That's correct. We actually used our digital twin system to prove out this part. So this has a pallet system on it then? It does. We're using an Arrowa pallet system. And basically what that allows an operator to put a part right away and then start running your machine, making adjustments off of the machine. These grooves on the pallet, what are those for? So with the Arrowa work holding system, that allows us to use robot end effectors. Oh. So we can actually, if we had a robot door here, we could actually be taking a robot, placing the parts, Again, with high precision repeatability, we have something in the lobby I can show you. I'd love to see it. Awesome. So Jesse, here's the robotic system with the CNC together that I was talking about. Yeah, really neat. It seems like this would be huge for addressing some of the workforce challenges we have today in the manufacturing industry. Yeah, absolutely. You can see that the robotic cell is loading the parts. It's an integrated system between the robot and the CNC together and it's a lot more efficient. But you're still not eliminating jobs, right? Because now there are higher tech jobs. You gotta learn how to do these robotics and how all these systems play together. So it's really, really pretty interesting. You gotta get the next generation educated and that digital twinning really seems to pull in accessibility for education, right? Because it's not a huge expensive piece of CNC machine with a robot. You can do that right on a computer screen. Absolutely. So basically with the digital twin and the robotic cell and the CNC all coming together, you have a very efficient and safe system and you save a lot of downtime by being able to use the virtual system prior to actually running apart. So Dave, I really appreciate you walking us around today. Some awesome technology in here and really a cool facility. Thanks for coming in. Yeah.